Tobit. Chapter 7 They came to Ekbatana, and arrived at the house of Ragel. But Sarah met them, and she greeted them, and they her. Then she brought them into the house. Ragel said to Edna his wife, This young man really resembles Tobit my cousin. And Ragel asked them, Where are you two from, kindred? They said to him, We are of the sons of Naphtali, who are captives in Nineveh. He said to them, Do you know Tobit our brother? They said, We know him. Then he said to them, Is he in good health? They said, He is both alive, and in good health. Tobias said, He is my father. And Ragel sprang up, and kissed him, wept, blessed him, and said to him, You are the son of an honest and good man. When he had heard that Tobit had lost his sight, he was grieved, and wept. And Edna his wife and Sarah his daughter wept. They received them gladly, and they killed a ram of the flock, and served them meat. But Tobias said to Raphael, Brother Azarias, speak of those things of which you talked about in the way, and let the matter be finished. So he communicated the thing to Ragel. Ragel said to Tobias, Eat, drink, and make merry. For it belongs to you to take my child. However I will tell you the truth. I have given my child to seven men, and whenever they came in to her, they died in the night. But for the present be merry. And Tobias said, I will taste nothing here, until you all make a covenant and enter into that covenant with me. Ragel said, Take her to yourself from now on according to custom. You are her relative, and she is yours. The merciful God will give all good success to you. And he called his daughter Sarah, and took her by the hand, and gave her to be wife of Tobias, and said, Behold, take her to yourself after the law of Moses, and lead her away to your father. And he blessed them. He called Edna his wife, then took a book, wrote a contract, and sealed it. Then they began to eat. And Ragel called his wife Edna, and said to her, Sister, prepare the other chamber, and bring her in there. She did as he asked her, and brought her in there. She wept, and she received the tears of her daughter, and said to her, Be comforted, my child. May the Lord of heaven and earth give you favor for this your sorrow. Be comforted, my daughter. Thanks for listening. If you liked our video give us a thumbs up and subscribe, it really helps.